Hello, how are you? Today we are going to learn uh, on how to crochet. Yes, for absolute beginners. So you have your yarn. Of course you need a yarn. I'm using uh, this Robin 100% acrylic. And in it, I'm using the chunky one. You can use the thin one. I don't know how it's called. Yeah, so I'm using this green, turquoise green color, something, I think so. We'll also need a scissors to cut the yarn. We also need uh, a hook. I'm using the 2.5 millimeter hook. You can use any hook you have, whichever is available. So we are going to start by making a knob, a knot. You hold uh, the yarn like this and then put it in a crisscrossing format like I'm doing. I hope you're watching so that you can see what I'm doing exactly. And then put your two fingers in the middle of the knot and pull the other remaining yarn. The one that is not shorter, the long one. Yeah, there you have your starting knot. So we are going to make a chain in whatever crocheting you're doing, you will have to start with a, a chain. So you hold your yarn like I'm doing. Then you put your hook in be in the middle of that knot that we made earlier. And then you're ready. So you're going to scoop the yarn that, that, that this way. I hope you're watching. And then... Pull it through the knot. So that is one chain. Another one. It's just that simple. So you're going to make three, uh, not three, ele 10 or 11 chain, uh, single chains, depending on the length of the crocheting that you want to do. So I made 11. This is how it's looking. It's just a simple, it's very simple. And we are going to start uh, the rows. So you're going to skip the first chain where you finished and then use the second one. So we are, we are crocheting single crochets that way. That is one. Then the second one. So you're going to do that way all the way to the end of the row. Let me show you how I do it to the end of the row so that you can uh, grasp the idea. Pull through, uh, dig through the chain, pull through, and then another crochet, single crochet. It's just called that way. I don't know why. So when you reach the end of the the end of the chain, depending on the pattern that you want to make, also different patterns are done differently. You will after you reach the end of the crochet, you will add another chain, a single chain, like so. Uh, just yes, like that one that way and then you turn around and then start again yes depending on the pattern you want to do this this one uh, might look like uh, mixing <coughs> the inner part and the outer part if you want only the inner part to show um, in my subsequent videos I'm going to show you how you can crochet uh, pattern that is similar all through so again you will just go through the row up to the end if you reach when you reach the other end uh, before you, uh, the last single crochet that you're going to make you're going to take the double double spaces you will see what I mean exactly and in this one in the middle you're just taking a single one 
but now we are at the end let's do this so this is the single one there are two at the end so that is one and the second this one will enable you to have um, a straight edge yes that's how it looks I have done two rows you can do another uh, chain and then turn it around so you're going to do this way until your desired length or your desired uh, width uh, in, in whatever thing that you're making. You might be making a skirt, a top, bikini, anything. That's how you start. Uh, if you want to see other patterns and other videos or how to make a crochet skirt, or a bikini leave a comment in the comment section and i'll sure give you a video on that so that yeah we've reached the other end i'm also going to show you one more time so that if you did not get it in the previous row you can get so these are one two yeah and then put your hook through both of them in every end make sure you do that one if you don't your pattern won't be straight at the end unless you want to add or reduce your pattern to the middle you will have to do that so that is how you can crochet for a very very fast for the very very first time that is how to do it thank you so much for watching uh, oh, I have not shown you how to finish a crochet. So here we go. Uh, you after reaching the other side and making the and making that one chain, you have to cut the yarn. Yes, use your scissors. Come in handy right here. Cut the yarn, and then pull through pull through the yarn like so and then fasten tighten the the end so that it does not come off and then you are done thank you so much for watching this video if you liked it please give it a thumbs up and also subscribe